Hello students, uh, how are you today? I hope, uh, I hope to be fine and feeling well and sad you were listening and uh, okay, you know that physics and mathematics or science subjects uh, is depends on how to solve the questions. If you solve the questions more, you learn better physics and mathematics. Okay. Uh, I I want to what I want to do uh, what I want to do in this video is talk about is talk about difference between scalar quantity and vector quantity. What is a scalar quantity? A scalar quantity are those quantity that have just just have magnitude. You know magnitude. A scalar quantity are those quantity that just have magnitude. Example are, tell me next, okay, it is distance. Distance is a scalar quantity. Red, right, beautiful for you, okay, distance. Distance is uh, quantity. Quantity, why distance is quantity? Because we measure distance. Distance is a scalar quantity. Mass. Mass is quantity. Which quantity? Is scalar quantity. Why? Because it has just magnitude. Okay? You want to go shop and you say for shopkeeper, Give me one kilo sugar. You do not say, you do not say that give me one kilo sugar to waste to ride. It doesn't have direction. Just mass has uh, magnitude. It doesn't have direction. And also distance. Length. You know length. Length is also a scalar quantity because it has just magnitude. For example, the length of this marker is 10 cm. It has just magnitude. It doesn't have direction. Okay, also time. Time is also a scalar quantity. What time is it? Time is, for example, 2, pa two past 30. Just has magnitude. Okay, do you understand what is a scalar quantity? Now, come to vector quantity what is vector quantity vector quantity are those quantity that have magnitude and direction for example velocity velocity is is vector quantity suppose It is a car. Oh, such a beautiful car. I draw. Okay, it doesn't matter. It's a car. The car is moving with 20 meters per second. To what? To right. What is the speed of this car? 20 meters. 20 meter per second to right. It means it has, this is 20 meter per second is magnitude. What is right? Right is direction. Because of that we say that velocity is a vector quantity. It has magnitude and direction. Now, come to force. I will give you another example. Force is also a vector quantity. Why? Because it has magnitude and direction. For example, it is, okay, suppose it is an object. This object has mass. We exert the force. We exert the force. It means we, we exert the force. This force is, for example, 5 Newton. Okay, now, you see, the force has magnitude 5 Newton. What is the direction? Direction is left to right. Okay, 
This, uh, okay, do you understand? Okay, and also I will give another example. Force, velocity, and also we have acceleration. Displacement. Do you know displacement? Displacement. The acceleration, displacement, these are all vector quantity because it has magnitude and direction. Okay, my students, you understood the difference between scalar quantity and vector quantity. Okay, thank you for your watching and follow our YouTube channel. Goodbye, see you next time.